the video's like, like, look at these idiots. <laughs> no, I would also be extremely proud. We're back in Goedverwacht. We had a really, really successful uh, meeting in Portoville, our first meeting last night. And we're going back to the office to plan for the launch with the Flow Ambassadors. So we're sitting here in Goedverwacht with um, Lorenzo Fioramonte. He is from the University of Pretoria and he's linked to the Global Wellbeing Lab. And he's here as part of a sensing journey to um, spend some time with us in the Flow Project. Lorenzo, um, what did you think of last night? I think it was a very interesting experience. I think very dynamic, very um, also interesting from the perspective of cultural and, and um, human interaction between the different participants. It is the first time I see like setting up a currency system from the very beginning. What I've seen is systems that already exist, that are already operating and the difficulties and the problems. It was extremely interesting. I, 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 I love the dynamism and the, you know, that sort of the vibe and the chemistry that was there. I think, uh, I think it has got a lot of potential. Um, as always, I presume, you know, like setting up something from scratch has difficulties and problems that, that you don't face when things are already up and running. So I wish you all the best of luck, I think. It's a great. Thank you. This, this initiative that you're um, carrying out here is really part of a global vision. So you're, there are hundreds of thousands of people doing similar experiments in other parts of the world. You've shown some of them last night. Um, there's so much potential that initiatives like this could generate in changing the way in which we have organized our societies. You know? So one day, maybe you're going to look back when you're going to be a grandfather or a grandmother and look back and say, you know, this is when it started. This is how things really, they do start. You know, when people change the world, they don't know they're changing the world. They know afterwards that that was actually when the world started changing. So uh, don't, you know, be humble, be modest and so on and so forth. But remember that if these initiatives succeed, you may very well be in a position to say, I was part of that big change.